Hello and welcome back to something of favorite. In today's video, we will be exploring the different cursor available in Stretto and how to use them effectively. Let's get started. After you open a Stretto, you will notice, this, notice that there are different kind of cursors available in Stretto. The default cursor is that of beam selection, element selection that is from members, beam or column. This is used to select any linear member element in the shape. Besides it, there is a node cursor which is used to select nodes only. It will select everything, it will select the nodes in the structure only. The other one is beam cursor. This is the default version that we that step by default gives you. When you press escape, it tends to change back to beam cursor. Then there is a plate cursor which is extensively used to select the plates only. This is a plate member and we can select the plate to plate cursor. Double clicking on any of the member will open the query window. Then next to it is solid cursor. It is used to select solid element. As you can see, this is the solid element. So you can select it to the solid cursor only. And there is members cursor, physical member cursor. If you have created any physical member in this model, it will select that. As you can see, it is not selecting any other member, but only the one that is generated as physical member. We have formed it as a physical member, that is why it is selecting it. Then there is a plate and solid cursor. It can simultaneously select plate as well as solid. When you are working or dealing with plates and solids together and you want to select it, you have to use plate and solid cursor. By previous selection, you can select the previously selected last item. By load cursor, you can edit the load in graphical user interface without going to <coughs> the loading window. Not selecting it. Why? Then we have to go to load cost. Then we have to select. Then there is load cursor, which is used to edit the loads directly. Double clicking on any of the load will open the load window and you can change the loads as you wish. Then the most beneficial cursor is geometry cursor. It selects everything, almost everything out there. It selects nodes, beams, plates, solids, etc. Everything. When you don't know what you want to select or you want to select the whole structure, you should be using geometry cursor. All the cursors have their own benefits. Use them by. Thank you for watching this video. If you found this video helpful, please like and share the same. Subscribe the channel for more videos. Feel free to leave your questions or suggestions in the comments below. See you in the next video. Thank you.